Welcome back everyone to episode 6, right? Is this 6? I do believe it's 6. We are finally back. Sorry it took a while this time around. My bad chads and chadettes. But most importantly, we got some leveling to do. So, I've done a little bit of farming in the background. Now, I hope I got enough of these. Because if we didn't, we can't farm anymore because it's Thursday. That will suck, but I think we have enough. So let's start, I do believe it's skill, skill, ult, and we don't even need to touch the normal attack, to be honest. So let's go boob. Okay. Oh, shit. I just remembered something that I may have forgot to do. We'll see in a second. Oh, never mind. We're good. She takes wolf stuff, so I think we'll be fine in that department. Okay, now let's level these ones up. Oh, please tell me I have enough. Oh, no. That is not a good sign. All right. Boom. So they're technically at seven. But since we have some constellations, we're getting an automatic plus three, which is definitely helping us. Uh, so that is kind of good. Um, now, I did do a teeny bit of artifact. Uh, <laughs> I did do a tiny bit of artifact farming, and uh, I managed to get a pretty decent feather here. So let's try and see if it'll go into anything cool. I'm aiming for crit rate and elemental mastery, but let's see what this force stab we're going to get. If it's HP, I'm quitting. Wow. I should probably like keep my mouth shut because I think when I say things like that, I like manifest them into reality. So I just need to stop. Uh, dude, I hate this. Let me try doing some reverse psychology. Uh, surely it won't go into EM, right? Holy, <laughs> holy shit, that worked. <laughs> okay, okay. No consumables found. Ah, uh, poop. Poop. We'll use this because this is utterly useless. Surely it won't go into EM again. Or maybe even crit rate. Surely that won't happen because that's not what I'm looking for. Bro, am I crazy? Damn, it's not enough. We're gonna have to do a little bit more artifact farming today, which will be fine. But that feather is looking a little hopeful. Is there anything I can fodder? Do I have some trash that could, that I could fodder? Not really. I don't have anything trash. Maybe that's just because all my artifacts in this game are just god tier. I'm kind of like that. Uh, what can I say? Let's go try and farm some more artifacts and see what we can get. Condensed. Give us something juicy. Dendro. Are they? Ooh. This is not the right artifact we're looking for, but it is pretty good. But, uh, I'm not sure who I have in my arsenal that this will be good on because I do not have Nouvellette or Risley, but we'll lock it. That is ass. Damn it, bro. Dude, stop giving me the wrong ones, huh? I'm really thinking about quitting if I don't get any of the wrong artifacts. <laughs> yeah, something good, please, 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 please. I'm so tired of farming this domain. <sighs> eh, maybe, but I already got a decent flower. So let's see here. What? That probably wasn't enough XP to level the flower up all the way, but. I'm willing to find out. So let's just go ahead and do this. Um, surely not a uh, crit rate or elemental mastery. I would hate if I got that. I would probably uninstall the game if I got either of those two. What can I say? What can I say? I might just uninstall the game now. It's probably barely enough. Oh no. I guess we'll use the last two condensed resin. That's my only choice. 
you know, surely we don't get anything good. If I get a god tier piece, I'm quitting the game. You know, it's just the way it is. Healing bonus, dude, that is insane, bro. That's the best piece we could have ever gotten in this damn game. Okay, I tell you what. I tell you what. Oh, oh my god. Dude, we are getting some good pieces out here. Look at that. Look at that. Just look at it. Are you looking at it? You better be looking at it. Take a screenshot right now. Now, I'm assuming that is just enough, right? To, to, uh, to, uh, to, uh, get this to 20? It had to be, right? It's got to be. Oh my god. Okay, I'm doing some sacrificing. You get sacrificed. You get sacrificed. You get sacrificed. And you get sacrificed. There we go. It's only five of these. That's fine. Will you look at that? <laughs> we managed to dodge all the other rolls. Okay. I'm amazing. What can I say? Let's go ahead and switch to that bad boy. And then... Now, I do have this other piece right here. That isn't exactly finished. This all can mean... That I can switch to an electro piece. But I don't even think I have another one. Which kind of sucks. I only have two electro bonuses? Oh, and this one's not even that good. Damn, I may have some good artifacts, but shit, I have some bad cups, I guess. I don't have the right ones that I need at the right time. So I guess we're going to have to just stick with the uh, attack here, sadly. Or we might be able to find a better attack. Ooh, this one has some crit and stuff. So does this one, but I'm using that on Eula. Let's just say we did use this piece and then this. All right, this will put us at a whopping 69. That's perfect, actually. And then 101 crit damage and 491 elemental mastery. All right, but the only problem with this is this piece is stolen straight off of uh, Nahida, but I think we can manage. Oh, that's not Nahida. We could probably manage with something. Like, we could probably use this, actually, on her. Let's go test some damage here. Let's go check on these treasure hoarders up here. Let's go ahead and mark these bad boys. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, This. so this is with her on the field. Oh. I am seeing a difference already, I think. I'm not too sure, but I feel like I'm seeing a difference. Let's try on this guy, this poor feller. Right here. This is off field. Seeing 5Ks in there, 10Ks. Ooh. Okay. Let's go over here. Oh, okay. 4.8. That's what I'm seeing the most. Of course, we're doing a little bit more damage because of Hyper Bloom. So it's not exactly too fair against these guys. But we can still see the damage there. 4.8. What were we seeing last time? Let's see. Uh, I'm going to go to that video real quick. Okay, so previously on the treasure hoarders, we were hitting like 3.5. And then on the, the hydro guys, we were hitting 4.5. But that was also because I used Nahida's ult and Sucrose, uh, Sucrose's ult as well. So that was giving more EM around. But we were hitting a little bit more without using all that. The question still comes to ask. I know a lot of... People in the last video said that ascending Fischl and getting her to up to 90. I'm sure the good people of the Adventurers Guild are absolutely fine. I created another Can you guys? Fischl? Can, can you stop? Please? Please? Thank you. Uh, you guys said ascending her and getting her up. Okay, as I was saying... Some people were saying ascending her and to level her up to 90 is actually pretty good for her damage. But I'm not too sure about doing that because, 
I mean, yeah, I could farm these again. But I was mainly saving these for... Where is she? For Kuching. You know, my first ever 5-star. And then I was going to make her good. And to be honest, I feel like it's more worth it because she gets crit damage out of it. I don't know. I need you guys to convince me a little more on a decision. So, but... As far as she goes, I think she's mainly done. All we have to do is level up maybe talents one more time. But that's going to have to wait tomorrow. I'm going to have to do uh, the Wolf of the North. Like, actually do it so I can get uh, get more of these butt plugs. Man, there's a lot of bosses with butt plugs. You know, I'm starting to realize that now. It's kind of hot. What? I'm still going to be farming up goddamn weapon material, but I might have to... Just keep this at 80 for long term because there might be some other weapons I need to level up. I still want to do some damage testing. So where is where is Musinari Mu, or whatever his name was? I don't remember. Now I kind of want to do a hyper bloom team. Is that an optimal team right here? I'm not gonna lie, dude. Barbara feels so weird to put in any team. God, if only I had Cookie Shinobu. I swear. If only I had Kuki Shinobu. <laughs> let, let, let me just go for damage sake and see how much damage we can do. See how much damage we're doing there. Okay, we're doing six Ks. I feel like we're doing good shit here. Okay. I mean, like, that wasn't the fastest thing ever, but... The problem is, official is mainly meant to be off-field DPS. We're gonna need some other kind of main DPS character. So Sucrose has to go. Let me think. Because realistically, if I were to try and 36 star the Abyss, I would be using Raiden Shogun, obviously. Because she is insane. So would I put Raiden Shogun in this kind of team? But she already does kind of do off-field damage as well so would i need fischl in that team no probably not so what is the point of fischl did i just upgrade fischl for no reason what am i doing here no there's got to be a reason why i built fischl is it because she looks cool what am i doing ayato ayato team does ayato team consist of fischl it's got to right that has to be good now i wish i didn't have to use bennett I wish I had Cookie Shinobi so bad. I mean, I guess that's a pretty decent... I don't know. Is Hyper Bloom more optimal for Ayato than vaping? I could do... I do Ayato, Beto, and Fischl for Taser. Cookie Shinobi would fix everything. I'm telling you. Guys, help me. What teams could I use Fischl in? Like, my immediate thought is she would be best with Ayato because... Raiden Shogun would have to go on a whole different team, or maybe the same team. I don't know. Could I go Raiden Shogun and Fischl? It just doesn't seem like that's necessary. Because I'm thinking Raiden Shogun, something Dendro, Bennett, probably, or maybe, maybe even Mona. Now there's a problem with Shongli. I could do National Raiden National. That could work. Um, and then that would free a spot to use Nahida on Ayato's side. So I could do Ayato, Fischl, Nahida, and then a healer, Barbara. Or what I could actually do instead is do Mona and put Prototype Amber on there. But I don't know personally just how good this is. I don't know how much healing this does and how useful it is. Someone's going to have to help me there because I've never really used this in my life. Yeah, I'm going to need assistance in this. But I think that's going to have to do for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. And of course. Okay, bye. I'm sorry.